All right, guys, today is Wednesday. I'm gonna do another one of these blogs. I switched the camera this way, uh, which is better for YouTube when that way is better for like the Tiki Talk. Um, but today we've gotta to make some decals and we've got some hats and a bunch of other stuff. I don't know how much I'm gonna get in there right now. I've got Stitch back there working. That's her name. We're gonna call her Stitch. Uh, and then I've got some decals getting printed on the Mamaki. So let me show you the decals now. Okay, 500 3 inch by 11 and a half inch decals for the Herbal Center. And then I have Boondocker equipment. Plows and truck bodies uh, in the printer right now. All right. Got some aluminum signs that we're going to be putting on these sheets of aluminum right here. It's three different sizes. You can see. And maybe I'll be lucky enough to get uh, some video of me applying them to the uh, to the boards. Okay. See that red line, the red smiley. It's showing me I'm out of ink. So here's my replacement. This is eight different colors. So I'm gonna pause this real quick. And normally I wait till it's done, but it just happened and I really wanted to show you. That's junk. Don't do that to one of these uh, full ones, that would suck. And just like that, turns blue. Back to remote, and it'll finish. Here's the colors I went with. Some people just go with CMYK, some people do double white. This is my color options. I feel the orange, the yellows, the light colors, like the uh, the light blues, you know, all that make for the best colors. And we've got to put this maintenance liquid. Also has to go away. Oh, don't look at there. That's where my desk, my messy, messy desk, and my pantry. That goes right there. And that's how we flush out the system, how we do the cleaning. Some of you guys might think that's cool. Some don't care. I figured I'd show you real quick since I just seen the light go off. So this is the hinge method. Normally, uh, if we were gonna laminate this, I wouldn't need the tape. Um, don't need to laminate this one, so we're doing it this way. There's multiple ways to do it. This is the hinge method. If we're gonna do a lot of these, I would throw them through the laminator, and uh, the laminator itself would actually, we would use it to roll the material right on. But because I'm just doing three of these tonight, it doesn't take much. I need to just roll on myself with this squeegee. This is cool for doing the bigger ones. That's your standard size. There's a big one there on the wall. Let's see, can you guys see it? Yeah, it's right above that uh, paper cutter. But honestly, it sucks. Sometimes simpler is faster. Simple. 
Put in the yellow. Now, if we wanted to, we can get yellow aluminum and chloroplast in stock, which we have both, I think, in stock, at least the chloroplast. But we already printed all the, de uh, the dealer's signs months ago in this exact same custom yellow. Hard to see right now, but this yellow is a toss between a yellow and almost like a, uh, like a DOT safety green. Maybe not as bright. See if I can show you. Super bright yellow. So if you see what I did, I went over by roughly between a quarter and a half inch um, in the material, so it'll have a full bleed. Now what I'm going to do is we're going to take and trim it down. We're going to cut all the sides off, and then we're going to round the corners. Hopefully you can see this on the camera. Most people don't want to see how the chicken's made, but here we go. I'm going to flip this make it a little easier for me. I'm right-handed, but I fall better with my life. I've been doing the same thing for 27 years, and this is how I do it. Now, let me move this off camera a little bit, make it a little easier. Don't mind my messy workstation. Both shops are pretty much remodeled, except for the room I'm in, the majority of the time. That's nice. The little baby bubbles, we just pop them out. And just trim, trim, trim. The bubbles just work out. Got three of these to do. I'm only going to show you the one so I can actually get some extra work done. I got in today around 7.45. Right now it's 6.04. So I'm probably going to do a 12 hour day today just to get the stuff done. It's Wednesday. We haven't been doing the Bullshit and Bear podcast for probably a month or two because of we're so busy. But uh, hopefully that'll come back in the fall. But because of that, I got more time today to. A little bit more time at work. Okay, now the edges are all nicely rounded or uh, flat. What we're going to do is we're going to round them, and there's a few reasons why. A looks nicer. B, if this is going on a fence or on a building, I can't tell you how many times myself walking by another sign, the corners these are sharp, super sharp. I mean, they'll cut you. It's, it's aluminum with plastic. So we round them so if people walk up against it, that nice round, let me get a little better angle on that. You know, it's kind of hard to see. You see how it's nice and rounded? That's a lot better when you're walking by it. You ain't got to worry about it, you know, grabbing a kid, grabbing yourself. Plus, not for nothing, if, uh, if something grabs it, it'll bend the sign, it could hurt the property. And again, I just think it looks so much better. If you're going to use bolts, and use a washer, it's rounded so the, it looks nice and clean. Oops. All right, let's see, did we get all that on camera okay? Yeah, perfect. It's a lot bigger than you think. Let me set it up and I'll, I'll move the camera. This is 31 inches by 48. Let me take the whole tripod with me. Don't mind the mess in here, but that is a pretty good size sign. And I'm gonna go ahead and do the other two, and then I'll come back to say goodbye.
All right, guys. Aim to go home. It's been a long, long day. Oh, my finger is in the picture. I'm really hoping you guys like these uh, these videos. Don't look at the mess back there. I got to clean that up tomorrow. That goes in one of those dumpsters over there. But uh, that's it. We did uh, some stickers. We did a lot of stickers. 500 decals for one of the one of the hemp shops. We did stickers for Boondockers. We did uh, three signs for Underground Auto Sales. We're gonna be. So what I'm doing right now is we're gonna close up. Victor, a uh, great guy from Underground, actually lives around the block from my house. So I'll be dropping those off tonight before I go home. And uh, my work's never done. But today's Wednesday. I'm going to post this first thing Thursday morning. And uh, thank you for following. Please like, share, subscribe, all that cool stuff that I'm told you're supposed to do. Goodbye.